So, it's Monday. Are we motivated? I don't know, stay tuned. So, for those of you who are new, I'm a Radiant Demarian, the resident witch and creatrix over to he a radius hand and Danae's divine where I create myth, magic, and meaning for your everyday life through art, intuition, and energy work. And on Mondays, I like to talk about what's motivating me or how I'm getting around having any motivation. Um, because that's the thing that happens. And I, I think a lot of people focus on motivation and, oh, this is this is how I'm motivated. And this is what I'm using. That's great if those tips work for you. Um, or, you know, or if maybe they're new to you and you haven't tried them. But when, you know, you have tried it or it doesn't work, then it's not too, uh, it's not too helpful, really. So there's that. Anyway, um, yeah, so let's get started. I'm also, it's late, it's late. There's, there's reasons, there's reasons for that. We'll get into those, um. This thing's straight. There we go. It's gonna bother me. I'm gonna stare at it. <sighs> All right. Um. So yeah, Monday motivation is a segment that I like to do to talk about motivation, and it's alliteration. It's alliteration. Um, because a lot of people do treat Monday like the first uh, day of the week, and it's the first day of the work week for a lot of people. Um, and so it's it's really important to kind of get started on a good foot when you can. Um, but I think it's also really important to acknowledge that that's not always possible. That's not always how it works out. And regardless of whether you're motivated or not, we oftentimes still have stuff to do. So um, how do we get around that? How do we deal with that? Uh, how do we cut ourselves some slack when we need to? And, you know, everything in between. So uh, as far as what's motivating for me this week, honestly, I'm not feeling it. Um, my little headed 40 weekend, which is really cramping my productivity just because... Um, you know, extended weekends always do that to me. And like, oh, I'm like, oh, I don't, I don't want to go back to work now. Oh, I've been off a while. Um, and then it just, it interrupts, right? And at least it's at the beginning or the end of the week, really. Um, but in their case, they had a four-day weekend, which means no Friday, no Monday. On top of that, the poor, the poor deer was sick. And so we have been chilling and max and relaxing on the couch while they've not been feeling really good which means i'm not away from them or doing anything um i did manage to get my three things done this morning but only because i did them first thing in the morning really um and if i had waited any longer they wouldn't have gotten done at all I'm like it would be now and they would still have been undone based on how the day went uh, so um i'm trying to cut myself some slack i don't begrudge um you know my little not feeling well, you know, you're not, you're not feeling well, you're sick, you, you want hugs, you want cuddles, you, you don't want to, you want to do anything, you feel sluggish, and, um, this one definitely falls into that category of child when they're sick, uh, so there's that, um, yeah, that's a, that's a whole thing, anywho, um, and it's okay, basically, I <laughs> This is what I this is what I did all day. Let's read this. I was um about here. Yeah, so I finished. It's all done now. Next book. Yeah, that was that was about as productive I was gonna get. Um, because picking up a book and setting it down is a lot easier versus trying to do anything else like um I don't know knit or check email because that was just gonna pull too much attention away from the wee person and I didn't want to deal with, you know, things getting spilled or whatever. Not that I want things spilled in my book, right? But, you know, it's easy. It's just easier to put down than, like, knitting or project or I'm in the middle of reading something and I lost my place. So there was that. And it looks like that's what's going to happen tomorrow. Um, poor deer did not get better. Kind of got worse. And I'm making the executive decision that weekend's going to be extended into tomorrow. It was better safe than sorry. I really don't want my work day interrupted because I thought I was going to be able to work and then find out, no, you're not going to be able to work because they've gotten worse or they remained worse. So I'm feeling like I'm kind of quit while I'm ahead. Yeah, it's a better way to do it. Now, as far as what I'm going to work on, um, over the uh, a couple days ago, end of last week, I did manage to get all of January from 
the 16th through the 31st all set up in my planner so yeah that's done um, my next stop is to make sure that everything that has occurred before now anything that needs to be migrated or moved or canceled or switched around or anything is moved up and all that's taken care of the other thing though about this is is um, after that I want to work on February and then I'll have all of winter set up and then I can focus on the whole okay get spring set up because that's I want whatever season I'm in I want the next season already done um, I'm ready so that way and like as of the beginning of that season hmm. mostly so that if I need to rearrange stuff I can plan a little further ahead and not like be having to put stuff in at the in the like start because that's not really helpful um hmm. however the other thing I would like to do is to finish tidying my office I've been idly getting some things here and there moved and put away um right now my project cart is just overflowing and there's some things that I've decided I'm gonna hibernate for now I'm not gonna worry about I'm gonna do something else and so it's time to reorganize those and um yeah stuff and things and I know that when things are cluttered it's really hard for me to think and because I've not had a whole lot of energy I do not need to like stack the odds against me however I probably should do it first before I do anything else because it's really hard to work when things are out of order and chaotic around me like physically speaking um, and I know I feel like immensely better when they're not so I'm probably going to make that the priority, honestly. Um, yeah, that's it. That's it. I, I don't have any hopes to get any project time done or do any promoting or do anything else. I do want to definitely always get my four things done. Of course, that is a priority. I've, so far, we've made it through day 20 of, of January. I've managed to do it. Woo! It's a big fucking deal. Because some of the stuff is like it takes minutes to do and some of it is it's kind of mentally intensive. So, yeah, that's it. I would love to hear from you. What has got you motivated? You know, how are you pushing through? What are you, what are, what are you planning? And uh, how are you doing that? You can drop a comment to that in the box below. I'd love to hear from you. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure that you like and subscribe so that you can get more updates for videos when I post them like this. Um, also, if you would, uh, if you're watching this over on Patreon, consider becoming a patron. That allows me to keep doing videos like this and to be really generous and to like offer these things and to do more cool stuff. Um, because you know, the more the merrier, right? Uh, as always, of course, if you want to find me online, uh, you've got both my websites below and all of my active social media. And tomorrow. I'm really yawny today. Let's see. Tomorrow's the 21st. Let's see what is your reward. I get to tell you what's next. Um, where is the 21st? It's the 21st. Do I have a thing? I feel like I should have a thing. I might be out of order. It's so fun to read stuff when I can't focus. I know I say that every time. I might not have something here. Hmm. That's weird. That's so weird. Okay. Huh. Tomorrow's supposed to be... Oh! You know what? I think I know what it is. Let's double check. Ha ha! We'll double check and then I'll know. Oh, yeah. No. Tomorrow is the Celtic Tree Month. That's going to be interesting. Um, I really would prefer to get those done sooner, earlier in the day, so that you can kind of let the information sink in and decide what you're going to do. Unfortunately, because I've already made the executive decision that I'm going to keep my little home and I don't want to do any videos while they're here so that I can, one, give them my uh, undivided attention, but also so I don't have to worry about, like, cartoons or weird sounds in the background. Um, as much as I would like the video to be done sooner, it's probably going to be done later. Just to, by the way, heads up. Unless, um, I don't know, unless I can manage to get through. I just, I don't have high hopes. So, it'll be later. Sorry. Um, but it's okay. Whatever. 
it's like the Celtic tree melts of Rowan starts tomorrow and like you get like a whole 30 days after that so it's not like the energy is tomorrow and ends yeah that's everything okay I'm gonna go I'm tired hungry snacks no I don't need snacks but I do need food uh, and then you know curl up with a book and just veg because sometimes that's what we need to do um, I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully bright-eyed and bushy-tailed and more energetic than now. Um, yeah. I really think I overtaxed myself this weekend. I, I did a bunch of errands and it just involved me having to do a lot to get them done. And I, I think that was too much. Which is boo. Low on spoons. It's come to haunt me. Alrighty. Any do. I will see you tomorrow. And until then. Have a wonderful evening. Bye.